Hello. Oh man, I feel like I've got my light in the wrong position. So I feel like I'm like really, really dark on like one side of my face. I'm actually surprised I'm actually like semi-functioning right now because my sleep has just been absolutely horrific with um I haven't exactly been doing <laughs> the best lately so um just with being upset over things and Mad Max is snoring it's just driving me bonkers and I'm just having a real lack of sleep right now <laughs> Hey, Gabe Rosie, how are you? The re... I was going to say rewriting, but it's just like, no. Rewiring. <laughs> A raised cover. That's actually pretty cool. Hey, Lady Autumn Sky, how are you? Gem with no filter, how are you? Hey, Guava Ball. Look more semi-functioning to me. Oh, Jesus Christ. Yeah. Whatever. I'm going to have to, like, record his snoring so that I can, like, prove to you guys, like, how bad it is. Like, Sunday. So, like, the day that I did that um, editing stream with him, I was up from, like, 2 a.m. Like, I was trying to put my thoughts together because I'm so brain dead. Um, like literally I was up from like 2 a.m. I was just like, screw this. So like I grabbed my blanket and went on the couch. I'm like trying to get back to sleep again, lying down. I can hear him snoring through the door. And I'm like, this a-hole. <laughs> so if I seemed a little bit like off in that stream, I really was. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. I'm like one of those people that I wear my heart on my sleeve. I don't hide my emotions. I'm a no BS person. It's just like, this is who I am. There, there, there is no lies. There is, there is no, there is no pretending to be something else. Yeah, laugh away. But no, it's just like, I actually um, forgot the main point of why I was actually going live. Isn't that just great? Um, it was kind of, you need to put a clothespin on his nose. Oh, do you? Yeah, probably. Eh? Oh, man. Um, I, um, I just, <laughs> I just remembered what I put down as, um, my, my headline. I should have put insert instead of type. Hey, great day, mom. How are you doing? Are you need one of those background noise machines? Yeah. It's just like, normally to like get to sleep, I'm like playing something off YouTube. So it's just like, but last night to try to get to sleep, I'm just, I had like, just like a random, like old live stream of someone's on and I couldn't sleep. I had to turn it off. I'm like, you know what? This is just irritating me. And I still couldn't sleep. It was really bad. So like, I think I probably had about three hours sleep. It's not fun. Um, there doesn't have to be a reason to go live. We enjoy your presence. Thank you. I feel weird though. I feel like it's, uh, it's weird. Like I feel like I need to have a purpose to go live, but that's actually one of the things I was going to, I was going to say, <laughs> I hope you're doing well. I'm still in life at grandma's house. We know, we know. Tiny lady snores. Are you? I use it all the time. Uh, oh. If interested, I have the sound of crushing waves on my channel. 
um, with blackout screen so you can sleep. I'll have to check it out because I'm sure that that will would like really increase your um your watch time. My watch my watch time is something that I'm really struggling with right now. <laughs> Hey to Helen back. How are you doing? I can vouch it. We were chatting about him snoring. It's true. It's all true. I also have thunderstorm sounds with black. Wow. That's long. Like, how do you do that? Do you just have like the sound and just like repeat it for that long? I'm very interested to know how this is produced. No, because, like, one of the things is that, like, when I started, um, when I created this channel, I actually created an ASMR channel as well that I haven't used. I haven't put anything on. Like, I've wanted to um, produce stuff for that. But, like, I just found that, you know, you need utter silence like to make a lot of this stuff and then I'm just like around my house noticing like a little noise because I'm in a really small apartment so like even in like the dead of night like it's just like oh yeah I can just record something you know in like the middle of the night a I don't get it I I want to sleep most of the time I feel like I can sleep it's just in like stages of this of where I am upset <laughs> I don't want to say that I'm a super sensitive person because there's a, there's a, there's a lot of things that I can let slide, but it's when something has really upset me, it really upsets me. You know what I mean? And, um, so like when I'm on the, on the couch, like trying to get to sleep when Mad Max has, um, kept me up, I'll be like, yeah, you know, like. It might be like good timing, you know, like around this time to do like ASMR stuff. And then I hear my fridge. My fridge makes the most horrible noises. Like right now I can't really hear it. Probably because I'm talking. And it's just like when I don't want things to make sounds, they make sounds. And when I'm like, oh, you know, it doesn't really matter. It doesn't make sounds. I'm like, why do you hate me? <laughs> By the way, that sweater looks good on you. Why, thank you. I've actually had it for years. I was just like, what haven't I worn on a stream yet? And I'm cold. <laughs> I've got my, I've got my blankie next to me. Well, it's my, um, what's the word? What am I, what, what term of phrase am I, am I looking for? Weighted blanket. You know how like blankets are meant to be like that that comforting thing when I used to get like really upset with things um uh like our actual like doona for our bed um Mad Max has rolled me up in it like a, like a sushi roll to try to make it like comforting I can't believe I'm knitting these things online but here we are I think that like, it's so funny because, because I've been upset. <laughs> um, I was actually on the weekend ready to just throw the towel in on this. And it's mainly because like, if you feel like people aren't there to support you, then you've lost everything. And sorry, I'm trying to I'm trying to gather gather my thoughts. Um You know, when you feel like you lose support, you feel like you lose everything. And it's just like, do I want to, do I want to do this anymore? And 
it's if it's not fun, why are you doing it? Because like, I was talking to like Mad Max. We went grocery shopping, and I'm like, I just want to be happy again. Like, I don't, I don't want to be upset. Like, being upset sucks. Like, it really sucks. So, I've been trying to do some, trying to do some deep thinking, which I know is is quite a lot for me. Um, and he's just like, when was the last time that like you were really happy? And I'm like, I don't know, but also it was it was a while before YouTube. It's just like YouTube stuff shouldn't upset me. It should be like if there's problems, it's just like man, that's YouTube. Like who cares? But I guess that's what happens when you get invested in things and you feel like you're wasting your time. I'm struggling with YouTube making my hours. Yeah. Yes, ASMR. Snoring ASMR. <laughs> I enjoy it when you go live. We can all visit each other. This is very true. You know what's so funny? Um, in 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 my in in my in my thoughts, in my self-deprecating thoughts, I'm just like, I really feel like I was just like I was just I wanted to um to to look at some of my videos for like shorts, and I'm looking at myself and I'm like, this is this is the strangest thoughts that that's come into my head. I'm like, I really want to get some lip filler for my bottom lip. And it's so funny because I was having the conversation at work the day before going, ah, and like, we were like bagging out fillers and stuff like that because one of the girls had, had gotten filler in her chin and it shifted. <laughs> um, and yeah, I just had the thought, I'm like, you know what? I really want to get filler in my in my bottom lip. I'm like, I feel like I've got like a fairly decent top lip, but like my bottom lip, it doesn't really match. I'm like, shouldn't your bottom lip be like bigger than your top lip? And I feel like my bottom lip is like not in proportion. And I'm like, I don't really need like Botox for underneath my eyes. I'm looking haggard. <laughs> I'm feeling old. Uh, my daughter sleeps with sound machines, so I made the two videos for them. So no matter where they are, uh, they will be able to sleep for a lot. Oh, that's uh, that's really really lovely. That's so good that you did that for them. Um, sleep sounds are on YouTube. Just keeps playing. Alexis or Echo is what I use. Oh cool. I'm living proof. Mel lets things slide that annoy you. This is very true. <laughs> nah, Gravy. No, that's not true. How was the movie? Hey, Squad Bob, how you doing? Lovely to see you. Sorry I couldn't get to chat with you um, more yesterday afternoon. Or oh, evening? Morning? It was early morning of you, wasn't it? Um, I need to find something that has a very long repeat loop. Lady Autumn Sky, 10 hours. 10 hours, that's a really long time. That's like a decent, like, trying to get to sleep for a couple of hours. <laughs> And then trying to sleep for eight. You know what I mean? Uh, I've used a rain machine since college. Interesting. Does that gener does that actually like block out snoring though? That is that is the question. Does that really and truly block out the snoring? Because then I actually may have to try it. Actually, I should try to, to um, listen to some of grandma's stuff as well. I think she's really, really, really close to her um, watch hours as well. Um, they always have phones, yet. Yeah. I travel for work. I have the rain sounds on my phone. Oh, thank you. And like, you know what? It's just, it's funny because like I did the... Um, I did the driving stream last week. So because, you know, like I've gone in Discord and I've done the driving and it's been suggested that I should stream it. So when I, um, when I knew I was like an hour and a half drive away from home, I'm like, you know what? 
this might be the perfect opportunity to do that stream. I just, I just didn't, I just didn't think clearly ahead that I shouldn't read chat while I'm driving, especially while I'm driving like, uh, like a hundred, 110 kilometers an hour. I didn't think that one through enough, especially so like in my windscreen, my, my mount is right down in the bottom corner. So you can probably see when I've, when I'm live, you can kind of see a little bit of the bar and you can see like the, the bottom bit. So it's just like, um, maybe I should adjust my mount, but then if I'm driving and I'm actually got my phone, like normally, then I'm not going to be able to use my phone normally. It's just like, I'm, I'm like adjusting my mount to suit streaming which is a bit silly i need to like i still need to think like every day so um i still so like when i when i when i was when i was contemplating things when i'm just like like do you guys know <laughs> do you guys know that like that meme of where the guys is like f this s and then throws the paper up in the air that was me i'm just like let it all go to hell it's all going to hell anyway so it's just like if nobody cares i'm like i'm like you know what no one's gonna care that i'm gone no one's gonna miss me like oh that that's that was literally the um the thoughts and i'm like does it really matter if i'm here or not I know. So, I'm very lucky to have the people in, in the, the people in my life and the people that I speak to that are like, Mel, no, don't give up. <laughs> but <sighs> you know, um, so I'm just like, maybe because it's I haven't been able to film videos. It's weird, like. I have a amount of film videos and I think it's because I've been putting too much pressure on myself that I need to film videos where it's just like in reality and it's, do I really need to film videos? Do I really have to, do I really have to do YouTube? And then I'm just like, I've put pressure on myself because I've watched so many people around me on YouTube grow. And I feel like I'm growing at a very slow pace, even though in comparison to some people, I'm probably growing quicker than other people, but slower in comparison to a lot of other people. So I'm just like, I wanted to attempt to try, you know, I was trying to put pressure on myself to try to get monetized. I was hoping to do that within the year, but that's that's not going to happen. So I've kind of put unrealistic expectations on myself. And I haven't, it happens. I've got a full-time job, so I can't dedicate a whole lot of time to YouTube. And then I also feel that I am at a disadvantage being on the other side of the world. So it's just like, I think that I have mentally burnt myself out overthinking everything. And I'm just like, that sounds so stupid. Can you really mentally burn yourself out when you actually really haven't done anything? I mean, because that's why I kind of started streaming. Like when I created my channel, I never thought that I would actually be a streamer. I just thought I was going to make silly little videos. I never even thought that I would get 500 subscribers. Like, I never thought that I would actually, like, become involved in YouTube communities and, like, make a lot of friends. 
because when I started watching YouTube, everyone's just doing their own thing. Does that make sense? And like, it wasn't until I really started watching all the streaming stuff that, you know, you see, you know, like all the collaboration stuff and people going on other people's channels. Um, I don't know if anyone's really going to believe me, but I have severe social anxiety. <laughs> so it's actually like really, really hard if I, if, I'm not a, I've got to get to know people before I can really become invested. I've seen a couple of people come in. Hi, Mary Bernie. So I'm like, I've got, I've got my, I've got my two chats up and hi, Texas Jen. I'm not, I'm trying, I'm not, I don't, I don't want to be rude and not say hello, but I'm in a rant. <laughs> um, we don't believe. Um, I, I, ugh, no, I hate to admit this, but I, 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 I've been diagnosed with high functioning anxiety like years ago. So I tend, I try to hide things very well. <laughs> um, but you know, getting involved in all of this stuff is, was really like daunting and intimidating for me and so like I don't like asking people for help I don't like I feel I feel anxious asking like even asking people to like come on stream with me you know like you know like I feel like everybody has like everybody on each other's channels and it's just like Mel just streams on her own I've discovered that I just one other thing this is I just like talking and ranting to you guys and I'm like, man, that's so wrong. That's like, why would you even do that? Why would you be that person? But I'm like, you know what? I guess I am that person. Um, it's so funny. When I was, when I set this stream up yesterday, I had a whole bunch of thoughts in my head. It's just like I work out a whole bunch of things in my head that I want to say. And then when it comes to actually doing them, I'm gone. Totally gone. Oh, thank you, Guava. Are my kids sleep to sounds of one or the other? You do what is good for you. <laughs> we love and support you. Thank you. Um, people can have a thousand fans and one heckler and the heckler can stick in your head. It's... It's a hundred percent true. That's why I kind of did those those two little like shorts of where um thank you of where <laughs> speaking of shorts <laughs> Hey Wolfkinder, how are you? I'm so glad I got to speak to you last night in um in chat. Don't mess with perfection. No, no feeling. <sighs> Growing old sucks. Um, what was I saying? I feel like I've got. I um. I've lost my train of thought, which I'm not surprised. I feel like I do. My bottom leap is just horrible. I feel like my mum always said that like your lips get smaller as you age. And I'm like, I don't want my lips to get smaller. <laughs> Neither could I, Mr. Malloy. Neither could I. I. I was literally like, where's Mr. Malloy and his streams? <laughs> oh, I can't do that. It feels so uncomfortable. Uh, I blocked that tiny lady snoring, yes. Unless it's her allergies and sleeping next door. <laughs> well, that's what Mad Max is saying. He said that his snoring has been worse because he hasn't, because he, he feels like he's getting sick. I like Lee's story. 
Um, it's a 10 hour stream loop. My brain will find the loop. <laughs> I don't know. That's a question for Lady Auden Sky. I fell asleep in Discord last night listening to everyone chat. Mel had to boot me. Yes. <laughs> No, yeah, because um, that's 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 actually what I that's why I actually went in. I um I got home, and um I saw you know there was still a, a few people in chat because um I I I avoided going in, um and then I saw <laughs> and Texas Jet I saw that you you were, you had your microphone muted. And I'm like. I bet she's asleep. So I went in to, you know, double, double check going, is Jen asleep? And they're like, yeah, we haven't heard anything from her for a while. I'm like, I'll go, I'll, I'll go, I'll go. Yeah, I'll, dis I'll disconnect her. <laughs> it's so funny because Mr. Beloit's like, how did you do that? I'm like, because I can. I'm like, I have special powers. I'm an angel. <laughs> um... I love grandma's Santa ASMR. Put me right to sleep a few nights ago. I haven't actually, I haven't actually watched it. Um, I sleep with waves crashing on ASMR. I saw a sleep headband with speakers in your ears. Oh, was that on Timu? <laughs> um, I, 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 well, it's just because I know how much you love Timu. At least I've muted that. Can you? Oh, you've always wanted to, to try them. Uh, you fell asleep as soon as I came with Discord only to find out Grandma's house was in there. Yes. Uh, we love driving with Mel. Mel's magical motor cage. Oh, it's so funny. So like, um, what was I trying to say? Um, the actual like stream didn't get like that many, that many views, right? And then, because I'd named the one driving home different to the one where I was driving to work, right? Um, I think I just named the one driving to work. I'm like, oh, yeah, drive with me, blah, 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 blah. And then I noticed that it had picked up an extra so many views. And I'm like, that's interesting. Then I was going through some of the analytics and it came up with the search term. Um drive with me and I'm like well you know what now everything's gonna be drive with me if it's gonna get me views that's what we're rolling with and yeah I realized I actually enjoy Aguavra is the bizarre Superman <laughs> oh now now do they wear matching capes So now, now with my, with my, um, I wouldn't say it was my, my rant. It's just my, my, my inner monologue. This is, this is my place for my inner monologue to shine. This is what I do, apparently. And I like it. I still love your Australian accent. Oh, thank you. Matching wigs. I actually love the wigs. I love wigs. I never thought I'd be a person to love wigs, but here we are. It's so funny because it's just like, I'm like, I have considered it. I'm like, man, I go, I wish I had like hair extensions or something like that because that, that like pinky purple wig is like so thick and full. I'm like, man, I wish I had like thick hair like this. It was so good. I'm like, oh. This is 100% correct. I have not found my niche. Keep going. Don't give up. You've been, you've been really super supportive over the last week. Thank you so much, Mr. Malloy. Just um, when you and Danielle were on chat, um, I was actually, I was actually downstairs um, cleaning the inside of my car. Like, when I was doing my when I was doing my driving stream, I'm like, thank God nobody can actually see the details of my car because it's filthy. 
it was like dusty and dirty and you know like you spill your drinks and it goes all yucky in like the bottom of your cup holder it's like because i haven't cleaned it in a while because like i work like i've like for a long time like i, I drive around for work so it's so like i my my car has been kind of like my office and i haven't been taking care of it it was looking rather grubby so like i literally it was like so mr moore i was literally like listening to you and danielle while i was down in the dumps like cleaning all the crap in my car <laughs> uh you're doing great mel uh we just need youtube to honor australia but yeah no like um you guys picked me up which is the first like which is one of the the first times i've had a little bit better during the week are oh, you and you should probably consider that um one of what uh am i blind am i like not reading oh and you should probably consider that one of us are real okay <laughs> Oh, dear. I decided at the beginning of July I would make time to put into growing my channel. The expert has been um, a consistent encouragement. You can mentally burn yourself out. That's good to know because that's how I feel right now. Yes. Australia is real. So are spiders. I have proof. I took a photo of it crawling across our car window. I feel like I'm getting all congested. It's so weird because like doing this, you're just constantly talking and I feel like I get congested when I constantly talk. I feel like I'm, I feel like I'm exposing a lot of stuff here, but it's just like, you know what? Who cares? This is me. You're getting me. I wouldn't give you anything less. One thing I'm going to tell you is I can't stand BS and I can't stand fake people. Mm. Uh, if you lived in the US, you would just be a beauty. <laughs> but being in a country across the world, you instantly become an exotic beauty. <laughs> uh, most of your subscribers based in the US. Um, I believe so. So um, I've pretty much grown my subscribers through shorts. Um, it's one of the things that YouTube um, pushes out because they're trying to compete with TikTok. So I am kind of using it to my advantage. Like, because I don't really have like a niche. So that's why I'm like, with like all the lawyers, I'm very envious because I'm like, you guys have your thing. You talk law. You know, you can do all your trials and stuff like that. Most of it bores me to tears. I'm not going to lie. So it's like, I came on to YouTube for fun. And like hearing about grizzly unalivings a lot of the times is not fun for me. <laughs> so like, and also like petty drama. It's fun to kind of listen to for five minutes and then I'm kind of like, yeah, I'm kind of over it right now. I'd rather feel better about myself than thinking about like other people trying to take other people down. I'm like, I do every time. Uh, time distribution contract season comes around. I said hi to you, Mary Bernie, didn't I? Um, my advice for anyone, don't gauge your worth or importance of what people on YouTube say or think of you. Stay true to you. That's what I'm trying to do. So I kind of, I kind of, yeah. And <laughs> um, I know there's always going to be people that, are not nice so like i already have a gauge on that for youtube like i've seen enough of youtube where people are nasty people want to bring other people down but you don't want people that you care about participating in things like that you know what i mean 
It's just like, I hate that I care as much as what I do. So it's, I feel like it's a blessing and a curse to care. Grandma's awesome. I, um, I want to, I want to, I want to interview, interview grandma for my channel. So like, I'm like, what can I do with my streams? Um, I was just like, should I try the interview thing? And there's no one better to try the interview thing with than grandma. Yeah. Are you having fun? If you are, keep going. If not, just do cameos. Life's too short to be miserable. A hundred percent. And you do an absolutely fabulous job of it too. Hey, Tweety, how you doing? Too many women get too much. Oh, yeah. Hashtag facts. But it's just like, it's not like I want a lot. It's just like I'm tiny, the tiniest little bit. I know I'm going to look duck face. I know this. I know. I really know. Um, I barely have any lips when I get older. I guess I just disappear. <laughs> well, there's the whole thing. So I was having this discussion at work, right, about the whole um, like Botox and, and filler thing. Because we're talking about, you know, like the people that get like like the cheek fillers and under eye fillers, right? And like one of the girls was saying that she had because um, depending on like face shapes, people get fillers to to change the shape of their face right and also i've also seen you know like people that have like dips in their noses or like uh, slightly weird shaped noses have had i've seen that you can get like fillers and stuff like that to kind of even your nose out right but then you know it's kind of like because i watch a wide array of things on youtube like a wide array and one of the things that i've that I've come across is like this plastic surgeon reacting to celebrities face changes like from the start of their their career to now be like what's happened to these people's faces you know like Kim Kardashian and Kylie Jenner like the usual suspects but there's 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 a lot of them um and then there's the whole thing of um, getting Botox and stuff like that for when you're younger can actually affect you a lot when you're older. So it's kind of like if you start Botox young, you're going to have to keep getting the Botox because Botox is a muscle relaxer, right? <laughs> Crack angel. Um, and because it's a muscle relaxer, it, I think, and you know, like over time, it'll just keep relaxing your muscle and then, you know, like your muscles won't be able to fend for themselves. And then, so like this part of, you won't be able to hold this up and it'll sag. So you'll, so you'll like eyebrows will like drop and then, you know, then you've got to get more surgery where, you know, you've got to do the lift here to like pull this all back. It's actually very fascinating stuff. It kind of makes you realize going, Ooh. it's so funny. My mom, so um, my my mom had a broken nose from a ball slamming in her face when she was younger and she'd always wanted a nose job. And then when she saw a video of how nose jobs are actually performed, she was just like, no, 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 no. <laughs> She's like, I'm, I'm not doing that. Forget it. Forget it. My lips. I know, I know. I should just overdraw my lips. It's so funny because the, the whole the whole reason I saw that is because I look back at one of my um uh, one of my so like the uh, like one of my thumbnails. And I'm like, why are my lips weird? I don't like my lips. My lips are horrible. It's <laughs> Thank you for coming. 
it's so funny. Do, does does anybody does anybody realize um, or does anybody know the the background of say no evil, hear no evil, speak no evil? Yes, take care. Uh, Timu and other places has plumping lip gloss. You could do it for a video if it works. Yeah, because all it is is um, I think a lot of it is chili oil. I've seen oh, I've seen a, I've seen a couple of things of like DIY. No, I've seen a couple of things of like DIY limp plumping, and it's I think it's pretty much like chili. Uh, slow your roll, Malloy. Grandma's house told me that I need to to keep going. Got speed. Yep, keep going. It's so funny. One of the um. <laughs> Yes, please, everybody hit that like. I um, I would greatly appreciate it. Greatly appreciate it. Um, one of my superpowers is uh, figuring things out. I briefly considered doing a video about using Timu just for the village. I'd be fascinated in that. You know what, Wolfkinza, do you want to come on one time and speak Timu with me? Say, I need to get out of my shell. I need to ask things. <laughs> I'm just, I know it doesn't seem like it, but I, but in reality, I'm actually extremely shy. <laughs> it's like, it actually, I, um, if you know that I'm in chat and I'm not really talking, it's because, um, I'm, I'm too shy to talk. I don't, I don't feel like I have anything useful for the conversation. So I'll just kind of stay quiet there you go you're learning a lot about me today yeah i will one day do my team a week thing i actually i actually really want to do it because i i enjoyed the wig so much i think i just need to just i need to get my my self-confidence back i need to get back into the to gym to lose a few kilos <laughs> So that I feel better about myself to film. I think that's also one that also one of the things that's like holding me back. So it's like it's like a, it really is a domino effect. So I wasn't happy at work. So it's like I half stopped caring about the gym. Um, I was stressed out about all this YouTube stuff because I'm like, how am I going to get myself monetized? I have no niche. I have nothing. And it's just, yeah, knock on effect. And it's just like feeling down. It's just like I'm feeling down. I don't want to go to the gym. When it's just like technically the gym should make you better. But, and I realized that I've been up for nearly two hours and I haven't eaten. I'm feeling hungry. Uh, Seattle Judy reject, uh, rejected my advances so far. Grandma's house hasn't once said she does. I will bow out. A hundred percent. It's so funny because it's just, I can't, oh, excuse me while I adjust. Oh, I, um, like I've always said that I feel like I've never been able to like advance in uh, like careers because I can't kiss ass. I can't kiss ass. I never plan to kiss ass. I never will kiss ass. It's like, if you want my, my opinion, actually, even if you don't want my opinion, if I care about you, I'll give my opinion. If you like it, you like it. If not, well, I get ignored. You're the man, Playboy Malai. Pretty, uh, pretty soon we'll have to get you a Hefner Road and Pipe. <gasps> can we do that anyway? Mr. Malloy, can we get you a Hefner Robe? Oh my god. Uh, uh. Um, I keep getting, I want $100 from Timu, but haven't. I the same thing. So when I did my, my Timu stream, right? Um, I did it online and it comes up with the thing saying, oh yeah, you get a hundred dollars. Um, uh, if you use the app, 
So I've been waiting to try to test out the app for when I buy the wigs. That's like, I also want to buy more stuff because it's like, they've got lightsabers and I still want one of those like, you know, the, oh, what are the masks called with, with the, the light? She told me is to slow my roll. <laughs> oh, we'll take it nice and slow. <laughs> uh, my first team of order arrived today. I haven't brought it inside yet. <gasps> you have to let me know how it goes. Because you ordered clothes, didn't you? Um, I have a look into, uh, there are strings with that offer. It's legit. I've ordered kitchen gadgets and even a dress. It was amazing. <gasps> Is winter depressing in Australia? Um, I don't think it really is because, well, at least this season anyway, because um, it hasn't really been that rainy. So I can't stand it when it's winter and it's raining and pouring. I'm like, I might as well go live in England. But no, like this winter, so last year and even the earlier of this year, it was just raining constantly and it was really depressing. But um, but no, like the weather actually hasn't been too bad. Last week it rained and I'm like, why is it raining for? <laughs> you love winter. So, like, where I am in Sydney, it doesn't get super, 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 super cold. So, for it to get really cold, you need to sort of more um, go to the country. You need to go inland. So, my brother-in-law, um, him and his wife have, like, a farm, which is about a three and a half hour trip out of Sydney. Um, they can potentially get snow and they get minus degree weather. Uh, mine told me I had to buy from a select offerings. Oh, people were gang up on accounts to destroy them as best blockaders. That is true. Um, grandma's house does great interviews. Yes, yeah, she does. So that's, so actually I, I'm looking, I'm looking forward to it. I just, I just, I just need to, I just, I need to, I, I've never been like an interviewer. I've never done anything like that before. So I need to sit down and work out my questions because there will be structure. There will be organization. No fly by the seat of your pants, even though that can be fun too. <laughs> Cause that's all I'm doing right now. I've got no idea what I'm doing. No. It's good to know. I'll try it. I am... Um, Lower lip deflated. <laughs> oh, yeah, they hate themselves every time. That is very true. Uh, it can be hard when you're not a hater and get clocked and blocked. <laughs> but that's the nature of the beast. Got to roll with it. <laughs> Uh, I don't mind by much. I messed up the opportunity to get a PlayStation. For oh, I remember you telling me about that. I've gotten some things for physical therapy, but I window shop like a mad woman. Oh, I keep window shopping the, um, oh, I'm like, there is pom-poms on the bottom of this cushion. And I've been sitting on the bottom of the cushion. I'm like, what is getting up my butt right now? <laughs> Oh, well. Haters are easy to handle when you live with them and they, uh, they need you around to eat. <laughs> well, you keep spending all your money on super chance and you keep feeding them ramen, so. Oh, hello, Miami Spice. How are you doing? I'm happy to see you. Someday I'll have uh, stuff sunk, tuck, lifted and inflated. I just need to go viral on YouTube and then I can afford to do it. No, I don't know what I'd do actually. I think I, I think I would wussy out. I think I'd get there and like have a consultation 
and then like wussy out because I'd probably be like, well, you know, like you've got all these like lines on your face. You're going to have to fix those too. And it's just like $10,000 later. Uh, I've never ordered big electronic items, so I don't know about that stuff. Um, but I have great automatic salt and pepper set. Ooh, I got the little sushi roll thing and a coffee grinder. All surprisingly legit. ENTs fix noses better than plastic surgeons. Interesting. Um, you don't look that old, Tweety. And with women, I've learned it's best to go with a lower number. <laughs> Four-year-old twins, Lady Autumn Sky, if they look like all the men and women. I've got a nine and ten-year-old who are very immature for <laughs> their age. <laughs> for the lip plumping. <gasps> Hello. Past, how you doing? I popped into your live, but oh, what the hell? Something just happened on my computer that popped up, and I'm like, don't be shy. Um, wait, I'm shy when I meet women. You are not shy with grandma sounds. Excuse me. Uh, Mel just needs a baby scorp under her arm. Where would I find one of these baby squab? Um, I think a good reason is 10 minutes after. I know. I know, right? You know, like when you have a fight and then you think of the perfect comeback like five minutes later and you're like, damn it, I missed my opportunity. <laughs> cuckoo, cuckoo. You wanted me to do that on purpose. You wanted me to make noises. Um, watch the Chinese, how do you, how do you say that? Gua Sha, Gua Sha, Gua Sha, isn't it? Massage videos are uh, totally natural. I've actually got one of those things and I've got the, um, the roller as well. I have the roller in my fridge <gasps> when it's summer and you take that roller out of the fridge and you do that under your eyes. Oh my God. It's like heaven. Nothing beats exercise for a mood changer. Or a lot of money. Oh, you know, like it, it's it's so it's so funny because it's just like it's just like if I you know like if I won lotto, it's just like what would I do? And it's just like you know what? I just buy a whole lot of property, have like a personal trainer every day, go get my hair done every day, and just and it's just like I don't know. It is pretty cool, eh? I'll just smack myself in the face with it. In the face. Oh my god. Someone I know. You know who you are. Set up Timu as a channel in their Discord. Donkey's ass. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? Cool. I'll be working, unfortunately. I love the way she said that. <laughs> Shelly! Hello! How you doing? And yes, I'm live. Um, I really want to do more of those driving streams. It's fun. I just like talking to you guys. I think that's... So it's just like, I think like originally, I sound like a broken record right now. I think originally, because when I started this, I'm like, I need to have like a theme. I need to have a topic. I need something to keep you guys interested. Otherwise, what's the point of being here? I mean, like, no one's going to really like stick around and look at my face and hear me blabber on. But <coughs> um, that's what I do. I figured out, I'm like, you know what? Maybe this is what I do best. Because like that first stream that I had where I literally spent two hours just blabbing away at chat, just like chit-chatting, not really like having, you know, having anything to, to do and just talking to you guys. I'm just, it was, it was, it, it was so much fun and it's just like 
I wish I could have that all the time. It's just like, I just need people to chat with. That's the thing. And it was so funny because it was like really weird at the start because it's just like, even kind of now, I just can't think about it. It's like, technically I'm talking to myself or I'm in a room, not really talking. I'm talking to a screen live. And I feel like every time I get really close to this, my face distorts. And then when I'm back further, my face looks normal again. I really hate cameras. Funny saying that because I'm a photographer. Gen Alpha. Interesting. Um, if you hate rain mill, come to Texas. <laughs> Jen and I will take care of you. Uh, I will never kiss ass, but it was cute when Melissa Jane said it. I know. I know, right? What fun structure? <laughs> Audit contains clothes. Yes, you gotta let me know how it goes. <laughs> I love it, gents. All good. Completely understand. I can't seem to find any pom poms to try. Luckily, Amazon Prime days are coming. When is Amazon Prime Day? Because I think they actually, we actually get that in Australia here now. Yes. I know, right? Australia is actually getting something. Okay, so 11th and 12th of July. I said last, last year when I looked Amazon Prime Day, I'm like, there was nothing like fascinating enough to get. One thing I actually re I've been I've been wanting to get it for ages, but I never have. I wanted to get a capture card so that I can stream my Switch. I don't know how I'm gonna do it yet. So, um, Mad Max has a friend that does um, like driving stuff on Twitch, and I was just like, can you ask him how he sets everything up? Because I'd really like to know. If anyone has any advice, because I'm, I'm probably looking to be like, all right, let's try this through like OBS and try to stream it to, I don't know if you can stream simultaneously to Twitch and YouTube at the same time. You probably can, but I need to, you know what? I haven't even downloaded OBS. Maybe I should just download OBS first and figure it out because you know what I'm actually quite good at just figuring stuff out for myself because like I said I don't like I don't like asking I don't like asking for help I don't like asking for things <laughs> so I, I got into a habit of trying to figure things out for myself I'm a great researcher uh, ordered a dress to see what it was like. I wore it to a wedding. So I got, oh, 17 bucks. That's awesome. I haven't met grandma's house. If I meet her, I'll be shy. But you, you see her and like physically like, you physically like see her through another screen, Mr. Malloy. Ah! The button pressing is hard. <laughs> Um, I've just been tinkering with stuff the last few times I went live, but thank you for stopping by. Well, yeah, I saw that you went live, so I just wanted to come by and um, and show you my support because that's what we should all do. It's just like no tearing each other down. There is no need for that, although some people decide they need that to try to fit in, but I don't understand the logic to that, but people are weird. Oh, thank you. Driving streams are awesome. Uh, walking around while doing a live is fun too. Yeah, it was um, uh, to Helen back. She she messaged me saying that I should um, do like uh, have 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 an alter ego with my wigs. And go around asking, like, and, like, go around the city or something like that. Go around asking people things. 
with my shyness. I'm like, can you imagine? My God, I'm going to be like, I'm too scared. Like literally, I like, I get petrified. Like there was, a, there was a point in time, right, where I was working a job and I hate answering. Like I, I would rather send a text message than physically call someone. Right. <laughs> so when it came to a job of like answering phones, like at the start, I was like so scared to like answer phones. Then, you know, like once you kind of, you, you're forced into doing it, you get used to it. So um, I'm better at that. I still don't like calling things like, like Mad Max because he, he knows that I've got issues with that. When we would go somewhere, I'm like, oh, yeah, let's go here. We need to make a reservation. He's just like, I think you should make the reservation. I'm like, no, no. He's like, well, you want to go there? I'm like, no, no, I'm not doing it. He goes, well, then we're not going. And I'm like, that's just mean. <laughs> Why would you do that to me? But um, but no, like I, I think it would actually be really, really fun to – um go into the city the only thing is that now I'm like working out of an office so it's harder for me so like on the on the weekend besides a couple of like touristy areas the city's kind of dead actually maybe that's a good idea maybe I should go on on I was gonna say maybe I should go on a Saturday I don't know how my Saturday is gonna turn out that's a story for another time I don't know what I'm doing but I can go to a touristy area and walk around and show you guys. Oh, Darling Harbour. I can even just, you know what? I can even just go and vlog. And be like, look, this is a day out in Darling Harbour. And I can just set it as a, as a premiere. I'm trying to take grandma's advice and just record things. And then just put them out. Where I don't have to do everything physically live. Make sense? You guys are my therapy right now. <laughs> it's, um, I know that a lot of my, my thoughts are jumbled. That is because I am quite jumbled right now. Uh, didn't start anything big yet. Just messing around with StreamYard and YouTube settings. Um, what's, what settings are you trying to, to figure out past? No, I haven't. No, I haven't. I might do that tonight. Because I'm like, I, you know, it's just like, you know what? Um, I'm going to take the pressure off myself in being like, because like Tuesdays and Thursday nights, Mad Max goes off to rugby. I'm like, oh, that's a perfect opportunity for me to record. And then because I put so much pressure on myself that I have to do it, I don't do it. <laughs> So I'm just like, you know what? I'm just not going to think about it. I'm like, you know what? I don't have to record anything. I was going to swear right then. It's so funny. I was saying to someone, I'm like, I think I was saying to like Grandma and Malloy and Wolfkinder going, I'm actually quite well behaved on stream that I pull myself up from swearing <laughs> while I'm on stream. But in real life, I swear like a sailor. <laughs> Hey, when Texo, how are you doing? I'm so. I really want to um to pop into Discord with you guys again. That was so much fun. I um unfortunately I was just I was a little bit preoccupied on the weekend that I couldn't stop by. Anytime you want to go live and just chat, hit me up. We can do a stream. Yes, let's. Even you hit me up and you let me know too. Hey, Gunner Josh, how you doing? Um, my comment didn't come across the right way. It was funny if I <laughs> embarrassing to see on the big screen. <laughs> you know what? That happens to me all the time. I feel like I'm like writing something. I'm like, oh yeah, that's like super funny. And it's just like, no, it's just funny in my own head. <laughs> so I totally get that. Oh my god. I feel like we're very much alike. <laughs> oh man, I feel like I'm getting all like teary eye. Besides the fact that I, I that I nearly bawled my eyes out earlier, because you know, I'm a girl. Yes, I'm a big girl, and I 
I cry. I don't want to. Oh, um, oh, I lost my eyeliner, like my liquid eyeliner. I'm like, where did my liquid eyeliner go? How did it get lost? Did it grow legs and like walk itself out of the house? So I had to like hunt down my eyeliner because it's just, I'm like, I can't like seriously. It's it's my thing. I have my my little my little wing. Did my eyeliner grow wings because it was tired of me using it to wing? I think I'm smart. I'm really not. <laughs> Welcome to Guab. <laughs> Keep your hands and feet inside the vehicle at all times. Hey Lex. I believe it's against Twitch TOS to multi-stream. Good to know. But StreamYard lets you do that. That's the thing. StreamYard will let you stream to multiple platforms and the one time. But yeah, I was like, I was just like, it might be interesting to try to stream just straight to Twitch. But it's just like, I've got no one over in Twitch. I think I have one follower and it's Ash. <laughs> I have one, I have one person on my Twitch. Uh, some folk like to dress their dogs in cute clothing. I think it's a crime against nature. Oh my God. Like, so I want to do some reaction stuff. So I wasn't sure if I was going, I... I'm just like, oh, yeah, let's do some, like, live reaction stuff, right? But I think I – it's just, like, in my in my head, I feel like I'm more comfortable doing reaction stuff for an actual video. So I, I still have Facebook, right? I don't really use Facebook to do much, right? It's mainly, like, I just look at the um, – the reels and memes, right? <laughs> um, and so, like, I'll just be, like, flicking through, like, the reels on um, on Facebook. Oh, my God. I have found, like, I have, like, I have, like, saved some of the funniest things I've come across. What, like, in some of the, one of the things I came across the other day was, um, they they had dressed their, their their dog up and the dog actually like got and like went on a scooter and I'm like how are dogs like people? It was it was crazy. <gasps> Libby How you doing? It's just like it's just like Libby's here, where's just dawn? <laughs> I would rather text someone than call them. I knew Mel was a millennial. Guilty as charged. Texting is 2023. Calling is so 2015. Well, at least, at least I am like doing something current. I like, I feel so sad because I'm an old person that does like all these like TikTok transitions, but I just think they are so much fun. Fun. Oh my God. So I've been um, saving a few like TikToks to try some more transitions. And I'm like, I want more wigs to do different transitions. There's a couple of, there's a couple of transition things that I've, that I've saved. Oh my God. The show. <laughs> because, 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 because I've been in a mood. <laughs> um, if you guys um, see my... My short from yesterday. I'm like, I don't know if this short is going to offend or not. So I was just like, do I put this short out? I don't know. I'm like, you know what? At the end of the day, I just put it out. If if it doesn't go well, you just delete it. <laughs> I've done that with a few things. I'm just like, yeah, I'll put it out there. I don't really want it out there anymore. So it gets axed. Texting is easier, but again, it's, it's, it's my thing. I do a combination of vids and lives. Oh God, I haven't done like, I, I literally feel like all I do is shorts. 
which probably isn't a good thing. Plant a garden around yourself. It will help. I wish I could. I need more plants in my home. That's what I need. Yeah, we all hope that you're doing well, Shelley. Where am I going? What am I doing? I don't know. <gasps> hey, Tom and Jerry. You're my favorite, Melissa Jane. Oh, Canada loves you. Thank you. You're very sweet. I cry all the time. Liquid eyeliner rolls away. Oh, man. It really does. Mm. The thing is with crying is that I feel weak. I feel weak when I cry. Maybe because I've been around a lot of dudes and dudes can upset you. <laughs> and it's like, tears are good for you, releases toxins. Whoa. It was really bad. I actually made myself really sick on Saturday. Like I had the biggest headache. I'm like, this is not good. This is not cool. I'm like, dude, you like need to pull yourself together and just, it's not worth it. Because it's just like, in reality, I'm probably caring too much when... I shouldn't be wasting my energy. I can say for a fact that Athena did not steal your eyeliner. That is good to know. Now she just stops needing to eat clothes. Are uh, you missing eyeliner is being used as temporary touch-up paint somewhere? Probably. I wouldn't be surprised. Um, Uncivil Law was playing games at some point um, that chat could play along. Not sure what he was using. Um... There's a few different like game things. I'm not like, I'm not like a super like gamey game person. Does that make sense? It's weird. Like I like watching game. It's weird. I like watching games, but I don't like participating in them. Is that really weird? Like, does that make me no fun? I like to watch. Where's Guava? I know he's clipping away. <gasps> Hello, Robin. I'm so happy to see you. How are you doing? Me and, me and Robin, we're, we're sharing that our, our dislike that you cannot change the uh, thumbnail for a short. And it's very unfortunate that a lot of the times that whenever you upload a short, it will like take the most awful like screenshot of the most awkward part that you'd look in a short. It happens all the time. Instantly puts us into fix mode. I'm doing a mill. I'm driving, but not talented enough to read chat. To ah, oh, I'm really naughty. I really shouldn't have like been trying to read chat. So I actually want to do another one of those driving streams soon because it, it would, yeah, like it's, it's fun. I should, um, I was going to plan to, um, like pre-record like a, like driving home. So I'm just like, maybe I can do like, like a stream where like driving to work is maybe more live and then I can do other ones where it's um, not live and then I'm just kind of like chatting away because it seems like talking rubbish is the name of my game. <laughs> um, and then like do like a premiere or something when more people will be available to watch it. Yes, please drive safely. Please, please do. Um, tears are kryptonite for men. Oh, um, you didn't cry when your Nintendo went green screen. I did. 
Oh, don't get one of those creepy crying dolls. That, oh. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Who made you cry? Who's asked to need to be kicked? No one. Don't worry. <laughs> Just rage quit. I feel like I've done that a couple of times. Oh, the worst was Mad Max. There's like over here. Hang on. Can you see that black mark in the wall? That I haven't touched up with paint. Partially because I like to remind Mad Max of it. So he likes to rage <laughs> when he's playing Xbox, right? So one day, so like, um, he used to like throw his controller into the couch, right? So he wasn't throwing against the wall. He was like throwing it against the couch. So he went to do that with his phone. Only he threw it too high, missed the couch and hit the wall. And he was barely a meter away. So he smashed his phone to smithereens. True story. I'm glad. Um, oh, sorry. Uh, I'm going to bring my new clothes with me. I also brought a couple of tops just in case I don't like these. I th <laughs> need to stop eating my clothes. Oh, man. See, I knew it. I knew it. Thumbnails are important. I know. Like, I hate it. Um, I like grandma's house fingernails. Yeah, I was, I was saying yesterday, I'm like, look how, like, grown out my... Oh, God, look at this. Look at the state of my nails, would you? Like, it's shocking. This hand's better than the other hand because I'm technically right-handed, so, like, this hand's going to get all messed up before the other hand. Um, if you never rage quit to a time, <laughs> uh, to 600 ET, you don't know what the rage quitting is. Okay. I'm scolding you ladies and guys. Crying is processing emotion. Let it happen. Let it go. Then eat some ice cream or pot stickers and move forward. We're all human. I know. Oh, Mel likes digging up the past. I do not like digging up the past. I do not like digging up the past. I try not to. Do I dig up the past? Man. I'm like, I'm like thinking to myself going, am I messed up than what I really thought I was more messed up? Or pitfall. <laughs> uh, Titan sub probably rage quit. Oh dear me. Yeah, with their um, their Logitech thing in me, Bobby. That's such a like. I don't. I honestly like that whole Titan sub thing. I don't know how they thought that that was a good idea. I honestly don't. Those three dots on Mel's finger is how many people she's killed. Guava, you promised you wouldn't tell. Why are you exposing me? Does anyone actually want to know what the three three dots are? Um, you know, at the end of the line, it, like, I, I got it as sort of like a little, like, mental health reminder even though I still get in my own head anyway, um, it's to be continued dot, dot, dot. It's things, things will continue. Life will go on. And then this one, I forget that I'm like mirrored. Um, it's Morse code for M. So I got that one. I got that one done. So funny, I was thinking the other day, going, oh, I really want another tattoo. When I got this one, I'm like, maybe I'm done. And it's just like, maybe I'm not. Because I've got like, I've got like one here and then I've got like, like one here and one here. 
And then I have this here. I feel like I need something else like here. Apparently, my tattoo artist does good butterflies, the colored butterflies. I'm like, mm, I don't really want any colored tattoos. I'm not, I, as you can tell by like most of what I wear, I am not a bright color person at all. Well, besides, besides that, I do like pink. Um, and it's pink, it's not purple. If anything, it's magenta. Um, where was my thoughts leading me? But yeah, like, um, I just, I feel like color tattoos don't wear as well as what black and white does. And then plus it's just like, if you've got a color tattoo and do you kind of have to match your clothing with your tattoo? Cause it's just like, what if your tattoo is like green? And then you put on like something that's blue and the colors don't go together. Like they're two different shades that are not meant to be seen together. You know how they say blue and green should never be seen unless there's something in between. Like does that theory apply to your clothing when you have like colored tattoos? These are Mel's deep thoughts. <laughs> Do your tattoos have to match your clothing? Um, grandma's house scolded me over the weekend. I need that scolding. Was that the scolding that, that I, that, that I was in, that I was in chat for? Um, uh, massive black space invaders. Combat console. That was bulletproof. <laughs> and spanking. Uh, leaving the hole in the wall to remind Ben of his rage quitting is digging up the past. I don't point it out to him. I remind him of it every now and again. But hey, he did it. Not my fault. <laughs> Flatliners. <laughs> You're just not for those three people. Well, they shouldn't have pissed me off. You know. Don't mess around with Mel. She means business. <laughs> no, I am. Um... Now we know what the tattoos mean. Yeah. Uh, no. So like D, D together, that means M. So if you go and actually look up Morse code, like, you know, like, different you know how it's like the different lengths of sounds and combination of sounds together make up a word so like the two lines it's just they're two like longer sounds that are together that's m if that makes sense i know it's silly i know it's silly but you know it's me i i have i have stupid thoughts Mel seems like a wine person. <laughs> um, you know what? I actually can't. I'm, I've actually think I've come to a point where I can't have champagne anymore because I actually, it, it gives me, it gives me a headache even before I stop drinking it. Um, I can drink some red wine, not all red wine, so, but like straight white wine. I can't drink it. It makes me sick. Um, what I what I tend to drink is the Greek red wine. Um, like it's actually like imported from Greece. It's really really good. I actually, um, I don't know what my train of thought was leading me there, but um, I think that a lot of um, wines. Now, I think it's all the preservatives in the wines that are making me sick. Again, I had another discussion with someone at work um, and she was saying that wines make her sick. And I'm like, yeah. That's, and she was saying that she reckons it's preservatives. And I'm like, yeah, I've thought that for a while. 
so I um so and even if I drink like because I don't drink champagne I drink Prosecco and I only drink I sound like a snob it's like I only drink um Prosecco that's imported from Italy it's just it's just because I know that like at its source they're probably using I, I reckon that those ones the the ones that I've that I've had they've had like less preservatives and stuff in them <laughs> shame Mel's not digging up the past she's smart to leave him a subtle reminder on the wall thank you Robin take that guava put that up your pipe and smoke it hey James thanks for stopping by yes please guys please um Hit that thumbs up. Um, please, if no one has subscribed, please subscribe. Not that there's anyone here that's not subscribed. <laughs> um, and I didn't want to ask, but um, but Grandma's like, no, 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 you should. Um, I really, I really desperately need to get my watch hours up. I've um, put a lot of the my lives and things like that in playlists so if um there's ever an opportunity of where um you can play any of my stuff in the background (laughs) i i i would really really appreciate it so i think i'm on just over a thousand watch hours so that um that 4,000 seems really, really, really far away right now because I don't, I don't do super long live streams and I haven't been making videos and even my videos, like they're not super long, but, but yeah. So back to where I started, I, I'm not like, I'm, I'm not, I'm not going to leave, but I'm not going to pressure myself that I have to get monetized. I have to do this and I have to do that because then it's not fun. It just, that's not why I started my channel. It's actually it's weird um I actually found the thing of where it was it was my my inspiration to start my channel it's a little bit it's been a little bit pitiful of myself because it's like wow it's already been like a year and I feel like I I I've made progress but not a lot of progress I realized that probably I've made more progress than at the time I thought I would make progress but in the grand scheme of things you know like seeing people like just find their way quicker than me sometimes it gets to me a little bit I've just got to let stuff stop getting to me that's the thing Uh, for those who have never played pitfall 2 um, if you hit any monster or fall down any hole that you start over and it took 30 minutes, oh, get through the whole thing. <gasps> oh, no, this isn't Morse code. I already explained that one. Wine gives me lockjaw. Oof. <laughs> what are you on about? Guava kind of like when you finally get to Mike Tyson on Punch Out and you go down on the first hit. (laughs) Yes, please. Thank you, Jen. Thank you so much. Oh, you're so lovely. Thank you so much. Like, I, I really, I really appreciate you guys and all your support. Like I said, um, I, I pretty much was, was ready to walk away thinking, um, that I wouldn't really have any support and I wasn't really gonna, I wouldn't really be missed. And then 
after speaking to some people, I realized it's like, does that matter? Because I kind of half feel like I've lost a place of where I fit in. Or did I really fit in to start with? You know what I mean? And it's just like, I came to the conclusion of it's just like, you know what? People that want to support me will support me. Those that don't, it doesn't, it doesn't matter anymore. Then they, they weren't worth my time anyway. So, um, I started this channel for me and I've just got to keep doing what I want for me. And eventually it's just, this shouldn't be a race. It shouldn't be a competition. It's meant to be fun. And I think I've really lost sight of that and got really down. They're burying more fiber here. Oh. Yeah. Like my, they messed around with um, the MBN here. And now like my internet connection is shocking like I keep telling Mad Max because it's in his name so he's the one that has to physically call and do it and I'm like you have to call and tell him this is rubbish we are going to leave and find someone else if you don't fix it see ya I love the thing it's like see ya I wouldn't want to be ya uh, 4,000 hours 40 of us just need to watch 100 that's a lot of hours Wolfkinder <laughs> A lot of hours. <laughs> oh man. But I I I, I appreciate the thought. <laughs> I really do. I love you guys. Um keep doing your thing. Stay focused on being yourself. People will be there. You've got that on camera on camera charisma. Having fun. I really don't feel like I do. I feel very awkward. Very awkward. I'm just like, man, why the hell are people watching me? I'm like the weirdest person to watch. I feel like, is I'm like, is it just the accent? And then I feel like people don't understand me because of my accent. Don't give up. It's Malloy. <gasps> Hello, Ash. How you doing? Oh, thank you. I'm trying not to. I know. I love you guys so much. Like, um, you guys have gotten me, gotten me through a lot. They aren't worth your time. Yep. This is true. Now you're getting it. Do it your way for yourself. I know. It's just like, I don't know why I didn't. Why I lost track of that, I think you get like swept up in the whole YouTube thing. Like you become involved in so many things as like both someone who watches and someone that's a, a creator, you get swept up in different things. And, you know, like you see what, other people are doing what's successful for some people and not successful for others and you want to be successful like you don't want to go into this and fail but like god there's like a little my hair is weird um but like the in the grand scheme of when you look at the statistics for youtube majority of people don't make it like, I think even the amount of people that um, attempt YouTube and get monetized in comparison to however many people start channels is very small. So those people that have, you know, like like to be in our community and have so many people around us that are that are monetized 
like it's actually a, an incredible thing. It's it's actually really amazing. I remember watching um um Star Wars Theory. Um, it was him and one of the other guys. I can't remember his name. Um, like they were doing their like they were doing like their their nerdy live stream thing, right? Oh, thank you for dropping links, Jen. Yes, please. Um, anyone who's new um, and are not following everybody else, please do. You know, we love to, we love to share and support. So, um, yeah. And someone had sent a super chat in asking how, like how, you know, just about like channel growth or something like that, because these guys have like millions of subs, but the thing is they've been doing it for years like years and years and years so like it's you know some people have been extremely lucky to gain you know like decent subscriber um counts in short period of time but a lot of these other guys have been around for like 10 years when youtube wasn't what it is today you know there was a smaller smaller amount of people back then so there was a smaller amount of people to watch so you know like i feel like in some ways if you had a specific genre it was probably easier for you to grow back then you know what i mean where i feel like you know there's like there's billions of people on YouTube. So when you think about it, it doesn't, you know, like the statistic, you know, shows that there aren't that many people that are, that are monetized, right? But in reality, it's still a lot of people. When you think of how many people are actually on YouTube, it's weird. I don't know. Ah, <gasps> Hello, Grim. How you doing? I um I saw the notification for your your latest your latest beat and I have to check it out. I love like like all the music stuff that Grim does. It's absolutely amazing. Enjoy yourself doing a YouTube channel, which is why I'm doing this. Just um just talking my thoughts to you guys right here. So maybe eventually I will do something else. But for right now, does it really matter? Does it matter? Does it matter? No. It does not. <laughs> Given your flashbacks. Ugh. YouTube is a lot of work when you have a job and other responsibilities. Just go at your own pace. Yeah, like I, I, I work a full-time job. So, and now I've got to be in the office at least nine to five. At least the office that I've got to drive to is on a good day, 20 minutes. It's actually, oh, it's been, actually been so good. <laughs> it's been school holidays. <laughs> so like when I, so I have a school down the, like a little bit down the road. Oh. Just the time I've got to leave is when everybody is trying to drop their kids off. And it's just an absolute nightmare. <laughs> so. Uh, completely not going to say put all your content in a playlist and turn. Yeah, I, I, I put all, I, 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 I tried to separate my, my stuff into specific, into specific playlists. So like the things like this is literally, I think like. What did I call it? Did I just call it like ranting streams or something like that? What did I actually call them? Hang on. Let me, <laughs> let me, let me go see what I actually called it. I called it something specific. So like, I think I started to put stuff into like driving streams. Um, I should have done shopping stream. Cause I did like the Timu. I did um, Ikea. I don't know if I actually put them in anything. But um, I've got Friday Night Lives in a playlist. 
I will get there. I'm just, at the moment, I'm just like, I'm not going anywhere, but I'm not putting pressure on myself. Does it matter if I don't get monetized in the year? No, it doesn't matter at all. I think, I think in a way I was just being really impatient because at the time I was just like really, really, really hating on my job. And I'm like, if I can make money off YouTube, I can like quit my job. God, I'm stupid. <laughs> it's like, even if I get monetized, there's no way I'd even like earn the amount of money off YouTube to replace my job. It's just like, what the hell were you thinking? Who knows? You might blow up. That would be great. You never know. You never, never know if you never, never go. <laughs> Does anyone know that? Or is that like really an Australian thing? Because that was from like a commercial. I can't remember what the commercial was for. I remember it was something with traveling. <gasps> I see the birthday boy is in the house and I apologize. I am not dressed correctly. I am not in the, in the attire of a sleeveless top. Hail, hey, where is he? I will get to you. I will get to your chat. But happy birthday, Vahala. Um, I'm going to try and stop in on your live stream. I will be in a job. <laughs> but um, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to sneakily, like, have an AirPod in my ear. And I'm going to be listening. So I'm going to be there. So my support is there, even if... My chats are not. <laughs> know that we love you. Oh, who are we kidding? Everybody loves Valhalla. Like, come on. He's just the ultimate cool guy. And let's face it, I'm jealous because I'm not cool. Hearts all around. I'm trying. I really am. He is like, holy moly. Uh, maybe I should go back to long form rabbit holes. Why not? Why not? Talking my thoughts is a good segment slash. So uh, I'm getting all like congested. Segment slash show title. My goodness. You think I was like drinking with how much I'm like slurring my words. Oof. Yes, happy as a birthday. Happy birthday, happy birthday, happy birthday. Uh, try not to burn out on YouTube. It's happened to me. Uh, but I pick myself up and crack in that whip and start doing my thing on YouTube. Yes, you do, Michael Malloy. Yes, you do. I have my two 10 hour videos on a playlist. Very good. Yes, please hit that like and subscribe. Yeah, that's true. Time isn't real. It'll happen when it's supposed to. I just feel old. I just feel too old to be doing this. I'm like, I should have done this like 10 years ago when I was in my prime. <laughs> Are you laughing about my sleeveless shirt comment? Um, the brain can focus on two things at once. Three, if you're Einstein, the time you put into YouTube detracts from other things in life. Um, only use social media to post. Consumption destroys productivity. That is very true, Grim. Very true. Uh, heck yeah. I know it's a rough schedule time for you Aussies. Unfortunately, yes. So I think that you start at 11.30 my time and I go into a job at 11. It's currently um, 6.49 a.m. here. Um, but yeah, so I'm not sure how long I'll be in that job for. Hopefully I won't. You'll probably go for a while. So I know that I'm going to, be able to stop into chat and wish a happy birthday there. What are your plans? I want to know. You are loved and cool. Don't tell you. I am far 
from being cool. Far from being cool. Oh, connection. Oh, I'm sorry. Those times are all correct. Don't get in trouble over my silly stream. Hello, it is your birthday. It's not a silly stream. Um, what was I going to say? I actually caught up to chat. Yes. I did. Well, it's just like, you know what? I got up and I did this this morning. So I'm proud of myself. <laughs> I did something today. Um, well, the first thing that I've got to do this morning is a portrait of one of the new guys that are starting. I think there's like two new guys actually no I think one guy's starting this week another guy's starting next week so I think he got I think he got the job but he's just like oh yeah I'm going to Vegas next week cool and so many so many people from my office are going to Europe and I'm like I hate you people he you guys are gonna be like living it up like drinking cocktails in like the Greek islands and I'm just here making my own cocktails. I wish I was making my own cocktails. What are some cocktail recommendations? Cause I'm not like, I'm not, I, the only real cocktail that I make and I'm sure if you know me, this is not going to surprise you. Espresso martinis is what I like to make because yes, I'm a coffee addict. Oh, another thing that because I'm like you know what it's just like I was half in the mood it was just like stuff everyone I'm doing this on my own no matter who is supporting me you love me you don't love me whatever I'm like if there's no one left supporting me I'll just find a way be like I'm just gonna do this I'm like Maybe I should set up my own Discord. I always kind of wanted to set up my own Discord. But I kind of wanted to like leave it. Be like, oh yeah, like when I when I get monetized and like um, can have members, I'll do my own um, my own Discord, you know? But I'm like, Am I, is that, is that really, is that really, is that really in the cards for me? I don't know, but let me know on your thoughts of my own Discord server. I'd put my own spin on it. I really would. Um... You would not have understood YouTube several years ago or had the support you do now. You are starting from a place of knowledge. You know what? I think starting when I did was good because like I had already started to build all like a lot of the friendships that I that I that I have now. So yeah, no, you're a hundred percent correct. I wouldn't have a lot of the support that I do now and you guys you guys are amazing and I need to stop whinging vanilla ice cream comes with a chocolate cake oh you know what I wanted I wanted a chocolate brownie there is a cafe um that my husband discovered so Mad Max Benjamin um they make the most incredible chocolate brownie and he discovered it because he um he went there like because he used to do the same thing that I do now right so go around driving doing floor plans photos all that kind of stuff so he stopped there for a coffee and they give you a little off cut of the brownie you know how like sometimes like when you order a takeaway coffee they'll give you like a tiny little biscuit they give you an off cut of their brownie 
like, oh my God, like crazy. So we've bought the whole brand. I'm like, oh. So I'm like really, really, really wanting that brownie. I should go send Mad Max out to go get one when he goes on a break from work. Because where he is, there is nothing. He's literally like out in a shed in the middle of nowhere around the airport. Um, so he's got – so like to get coffee or anything, like he's got to physically like drive out and around. And I'm like, do you feel like going to Marubra to like go get brownie? Um, if Val puts goats in birthday hats, <laughs> then we'll have to look away. <laughs> that would be awesome. They're all in their birthday suits. As God intended. Naked goat celebration. <laughs> uh, legal vices done shorts. Making traditional cocktails. Did you just mention coffee cocktails? Well, yes, I did. So, like, um, I actually make a hazelnut espresso martini. So, um, it's, I use Kahlua, Frangelico, coffee, and vodka, of course. I can see fun members on your Discord. But maybe a few select people can have early access. Uh, ASMR brownie. I'll think about it. <laughs> oh, you know what? Another reason that stops me from filming? Because I'll get home and I'm like, I really don't want to fix my makeup. Some days I go to work with no makeup on and I'm like, I come home and I'm like, oh, do I have to put makeup on? <laughs> I'm too scared to ask what that means. <laughs> Toasted pound cake slice with vanilla ice cream. You guys are making me hungry. It's like breakfast time. And now you guys make me want to have like cake and stuff. Add fresh sliced strawberries to mine, please. Oh, guys. Um, I just saw Mel's huge Nutella uh, chocolate cake in her shorts. <laughs> chocolate in my shorts. That'll never get old. <laughs> oh, my God. I love you guys. I'm still trying to get over that that craving now. Which one, Robin? So, because I had the two cake things on there. So, the one of where it's just the, the plane spinning, um, I made that... Uh, like a month or so. Yeah, like last month for my niece's birthday. I actually did a whole vlog on making that cake. Benjamin kills all the birds, keep the plane safe. Potentially. Maybe he does that as well. That's his other job. The brownies from Papa John's are amazing. Hot out of the oven. We don't have Papa John's here. At one point there was Little Caesars. I never, like, there was a Little Caesars that was close to me and I wanted to try it, but it shut down before I got to try it. Really, Guava? Justice for Mel, because Mel has to put up with Ben. I want a shrimp cocktail now. I have not heard that since you mentioned it, like when you called up um, Sydney's um, Outback Steakhouse, I'm just like, I cannot remember the last time that I'd heard like, because here it's prawn cocktail. Because obviously we don't call them. We don't call them shrimp. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's... Like here, it's such an old school thing that like, I barely remember it. I remember going on holidays, right? And we've got like, 
it's like our like a like a RSL kind of like club, which is Return Services League. So like for like army veterans and things like that, that's their kind of like um it's kind of like a, a club for that. So you've got um like pokies and like buffet and all that kind of stuff at one of these. And like as like I remember when we were on holidays, we went to one of those places because it actually had very good food and it had food that my mom was just like, Melissa will actually eat this food. We're just going to go there. Um, because I was actually a very fussy kid and I only like to eat certain things. You know how like kids only like to eat chicken nuggets and chips? Along that kind of lines. And I remember my mum always getting the prawn cocktail. <laughs> that was the point of that story. Ben Lives Matter. Do I have to boot you to remember whose channel you're on? But you know what? Mad Max actually does have his own channel. He um he randomly streams um editing his footy photos for the footy players. A select few. Vanilla ice cream and coconut cake. Oh that's another thing I remember as a kid. There used to be like this, um, like bakery and they had, they made a coconut croissant. Like it was like a croissant and the filling was this like coconut filling. I've never, ever, ever found that type of croissant ever again. ASMR brownies, where will I be able to taste test? I don't know, Guava. Do you want to do you want to fill them in on your idea of um, ASMR brownies? Because I know what I interpret it as. I want to hear what Guava's interpretation of it is. Mel's chocolate shorts will live on in infamy. Oh, it really will. I want to do Halloween, even though Halloween's not a big thing here. I half want to do like maybe like a week of like trying to like do like Halloween like shorts eating like Halloween stuff. I don't know if we actually get Halloween stuff here though. Like I don't know how like early enough because I know that we I know that you know like it's becoming more customary here. But um I I don't know how early it comes out for me to be able to create shorts with. Although I can just I can just do it on the fly. In reality, the shorts don't take too long. The the main bulk of the shorts is me getting ready for the shorts. Cause it's just like, um grandma was taught so like you know how like grandma did her stream with expert about starting a channel and all that kind of stuff. And she was talking about burnout. I, so what really sort of like got me going was my advent calendar. I, um, I didn't like, I'm like trying to fix my hair. Um, I, I didn't, I didn't think that people would enjoy it as much as what they did. Um, I, I never, I never planned it to go as big as what I, as what I, I went (laughs) And I, I, I burnt myself out halfway through doing it because I put so much stress on myself and I was trying to do it every day. And I'm just like, I can't, I'm just like, I can't repeat like outfits and stuff like that. Cool Frog goes to me, he goes, you can, you can just do the same thing every day. And I'm like, I can't do the same thing every day. I'm like, it's got to be a different costume. It's got to be a different like chocolate. And so, like, I put so much stress on myself to – because at heart, I am a, I am a perfectionist. There's, there's, there's certain things that I'm a perfectionist about, let's face it. I'm not a perfectionist about everything. I'm not, you know, like, control freaky about everything. But with certain things like this, like creative stuff, I really am. And so I wanted it to be, like, perfect. And all of that stress from that. 
I, ha- I had burnout like halfway through. I was like crying to like my Max going, I don't want to do this anymore. And I was so shorts. Like seriously, I burnt myself out from shorts. I literally, I, I think I like had like a month off. I'm like, oh my God, I need a break. Because I did, I did 26 shorts because I did like a little bonus short because um, Mad Max had brought home a Christmas donut. And I'm like, oh, I've got to film the Christmas donut too. What is this like? Jesus. Now I want smell a vision. I don't know if I'd want smell a vision. Uh, thank you, Den with no filter. Um, I used to celebrate my birthday with an ice cream drink, Brazilian monk, Kahlua Frangelico, dark creme de coco, blend with vanilla ice cream. I'm forgetting something. <gasps> that sounds incredible. Yes, yum. <laughs> All I heard was brownies. My large ass went, mmm, chocolate. Oh my God, Ash, I love you. <laughs> oh my god i really need to do this stream guys jeez oh asmr brownies involve mel baking brownies in return of the joke <laughs> not exactly what i was imagining i um Fun fact, I, I actually ordered the costume. Considering considering I just said that I'm going slow. <laughs> um, I know that, that that costume is not happening for a while. I'm still trying to find, I'm still trying to figure out the boots. I think I'm just going to go for the ones that might be slightly too small because they look better. The reason is, I know people are like, go for the comfort, but... I actually want, so the whole reason that I got the outfit now, actually, did I bring that home yesterday? Because like I, I got it sent to the office. I actually don't know if I took it home with me or not. Um, I guess I'll figure that out when I get into the car to go to work. Um... I, I bought it now to give myself the motivation to try to look good in it. Um, I, I found the wig on Amazon, but it looks rubbish. So on Etsy, I found um, a chick that sells two um, plaited hair thingies. So you've got one to put here to wrap around for the bun and then another one that comes and then drapes here. And um, I haven't had it yet because I haven't actually opened the package up yet. So I know that there, I think there's like a couple of hair things or you can buy the hair thingies. So yeah, because I wanted to do a photo shoot because like I said before, I, I've, I've done running at the sand dunes and I'm like, what a perfect setting for a photo shoot for that outfit. Cause I even said to Ben, I'm like, oh, I'm like, if I look good in this outfit, we'll go do a photo shoot. And he's like, at the sand dunes? I'm like, yes. I'm like, for once you actually finished my sentence correctly. It's very rare. <laughs> Me too, wanna to know what ASMR brownies are, but knowing guava, I'm too scared to ask. I'm sure it means something different here. I know. That's why I make Guava actually put it in himself. I knew it meant something other than what I thought. <laughs> uh, I shall not take... Uh, <laughs> what? I must not mentally go there around his Yeah, probably not. Never ask Guava exactly what he means unless you, you don't know. Yes, that is true. That is, that is, that is, that is very true. Um, anyone can try them. He keeps them in his base basement for freshness. Just be prepared. You, it might be a long time before you leave the basement. 
Um, I tried dressing up as Princess Leia one year for Halloween, but my buns wouldn't stay pinned up. <laughs> I know how they sounded. Robin, oh yeah. What is it? I did um a nerd stream with expert and I've I, I got the the full wig. I got the wig. Uh nobody likes creating YouTube shorts because YouTube kind of forces creators to make them. Well, I don't know if um YouTube forces creators to make them. I just like making them like I like the shorts that I make is what I like to make I like making silly little like transition videos it's it's at that that's that's fun to me so it's just a thing of YouTube is pushing out stuff that I like to make my stuff isn't super like popular like um a lot of other stuff but it is what it is. I have to learn to accept this. Guava is now on the floor. You're welcome. <laughs> I know, I know. Uh, go fund me a courier to hand deliver a package and we can put together a Halloween candy box from the US. Uh, would go through customs fast. Um, God, I was on the floor. See, we all know him too well. Are we racing? A hundred percent. Um, shorts do help new slash small channels get subs though. Yeah, it, it really does. Oh no. Oh, that sounds so gross. I have uh, got to get my Australian translator fixed. Is there an Australian translator? I don't know. I stepped away um, to chase mischievous puppies. What have they done now? They are so cheeky, but they are so cute. And I'm like, why can't the, why, why can't cuteness equal like behaving well? So rude. Ah, uh, you were smart. Went for the Princess Leia wig. I tried actually making my hair like hers. Oh, <gasps> that would have been cool. Your hair must have been like so long to be able to do it. But no, like I don't, I don't have a, I don't have long enough hair to try to. Hey, I'm, I'm failing already. <laughs> to be able to to do that. Oh, meanwhile, these front pieces of my hair. Are like finally getting to a manageable stage. Like it's finally at a point where I'm like, I'm fine. Like it finally feels like it looks half decent. And it's so funny because one of the property manager girls, she's a trained hairdresser. And after I just, oh my God, after I just had it done, she's like, oh, your hair looks right. And I'm like, no, it doesn't. It looks really, really bad. And then when I talked to her, she's like, she's like those front pieces are really starting to like get to a good point now. <laughs> I'm like, I know, right? <laughs> I'm like, I'm glad somebody else noticed. I'm like, you get me. <sighs> oh. All right, guys, I'm going to leave it there. I'm going to eat something and I'm going to try and get Mad Max up. Yes, I have to get my husband up like a man child. Um, he should be able to get himself up. Like, honestly, he sets an alarm for himself and he doesn't get himself up. He's so lucky that he works for his dad and he can get away with half being late. But, um, but, um, uh, thank you guys so, so much for stopping by and letting me, um, speak my thoughts <laughs> um i'm gonna try to be around as much as i can i guess it's a little bit hard now with work but i try my best i generally keep my airpods in my in my in my pocket <laughs> so that i can try to um 
to listen even if I can't participate. So just know Mel Mel might might not be around, but maybe she really is around. Mm. So <laughs> Alright guys. Um oh my god, I just realized I'm starving. Alright, I'm gonna love you and leave you. And I think I will be doing a driving stream soon whether it's actual live live or pre-recorded very uncertain yet but um i will be doing something um vahala happy happy birthday um what else i forgot what i was gonna say i feel like it was something important <gasps> i love you too mr malloy no thank you um like Mr. Malloy has actually been really awesome the past week. He, he knows that I've been really down and every time I've been in his chat, he's, um, he's, he's made sure to ask me how I'm doing. So thank you very much. Mr. Malloy, I really appreciate you. Ah, oh, thank you so much guys. All right. I will, um, talk to you guys later i hope you guys have a, a wonderful rest of your day Mwah.